great all-rounder Kapil Dev comes to the crease. There it is. That'll be the winning runs for India. They come back for the two. And India win this important game by fine wickets. Here's Richie Richardson, and he's bowling to McDermott. Run out. The last ball. And the West Indies win by 65 runs in a count at the Melbourne Cricket Ground. In front of 53,000 people, they batted well to score 271. And Richie Richardson is coming to the crease now at the Vulture Street end. He takes over from Viv Richards, who has bowled his 10 overs. Viv took one for 27 from 10. And I think uh, the way he practices his bowling action in the slips, I think Richie fancies himself a little bit. Quite a, uh, a nice little bit of byplay there between he and Gordon Greenwich. Both of them will be looking for a second. Quite a nice piece of uh, byplay, and also I think a bit of a hidden message there. Richie Richardson uh, had a warm up delivery to Gordon Greenwich at mid on. He banged it in short. And Gordon Greenwich signalled a wide. I think that was, uh, as I say, a bit of byplay and also I think a message in that. Here we are, up over the uh, the shoulders, the height of the shoulders, of the batsman. Gordon signals a wide. And that one crashes into the stumps for which umpire Mel Johnson is very thankful. When he's still got the time left on his wrist. That one, really the bowler cruncher, <laughs> the umpire cruncher. This one had a lot on it straight. Get out of that one, and I don't think he had any chance whatsoever. Marshall is at deep mid on. Well, the equation not hard to work out there, just one hit away from victory. Shout from uh, Dujon. Doesn't get much. Uh, Time from Mel Johnson. Leg by. Had he been fired out then, I think Richie Richardson uh, never heard the end of it. Coming on, picking up the wicket of both of them. Been a great day for him. England 4 for 152. 